All right, guys, I am back for another Tour 10 tutorial here. And this is my first look at this hole. So be interesting to see. Um, so I haven't played this one in a little bit. But uh, here you're seeing we are downwind here. And I am going to uh, play a shot that is more high in backspin. And... A little bit kind of counters that wind you see well, what I'm gonna try to basically do is kind of hit the hills at a specific spot uh, kind of right in here and as you can see this is the one time now it looks like it's gonna come up short but uh, with that little with that extra wind it's going to push it more towards the Hole than as shown. So here you're going to see me play roughly nah, 10 rings here and just play this wind straight up for the most part. And what the spin's going to do is it's going to make it come in a lot slower than, uh, and here you're just kind of seeing it. And what that does is it lets it check up to the hole. Here you're seeing 1.44. What that, what my approach just did is it allowed the ball to come in so much slower that it doesn't feed the hill and go uh, very far away from the hole. So you're seeing it just more die on the hole and be so low on the hill that it just has nowhere to go that it just stays tight in the hole. And I really recommend playing that one that way um, so you can find similar um, results as just getting it to come in very slowly and uh, in terms of a ring adjustment I like to play about 1.1 per ring on that hole uh, kind of at mid club but it just all depends on the wind as well I will play more of a max adjustment if I'm uh, playing it into the wind so it's just going to kind of vary from hole to hole, but uh, as a general rule of thumb, uh, about 1.1 per ring on the sniper is going to be pretty spot on for the most part. And uh, so good luck with that wind and uh, be on the lookout for more of my Tour 10 shootouts. So uh, I'll be posting a bunch more for you guys and try to get a bunch of different wins for this hole. This is the first time I was seeing that one. So hopefully I can get a couple more and put together a good guide for you guys. So good luck out there.